Hi guys, welcome back. Um, so, unbagging number one. Um, this is my order from a lady on Facebook that I bought a few bits and pieces from. Um, I don't know what's in it. I haven't, well, I do kind of know what's in it, but I haven't opened it. I literally went out shopping, came back, and it was waiting for me. So, we're going to get and have a look now. Um, I am just going to use my snips because I don't want to put anything inside. So, bear with me while I uh, just open this up. Ooh, I see pretties. I see pretties. Oh my goodness, these snips are about, about as useful as a chocolate fire guard. <sighs> Which, to be fair, could be quite useful when you fancy chocolate. Or fondue. Chocolate fondue. <laughs> But as it stands, these are, I, I really can't be bothered to go and get my scissors. I don't like using them for this sort of thing anyway because, you know, they're only meant for thread. So, we'll get in there guys, we'll get in there. I perhaps should have opened this before, but in all fairness, I didn't think it was going to be this difficult <laughs> with these stupid snips. Right. Okay, here we go. <sighs> right then, so, number one. There are some things that I'm not going to show. I know she's added in for me. Um, so, yeah, there are some things that I'm not, I'm not going to show. Because they are sort of little extras that she's put in just for me. So... That's one of them. So let's have a look. This one, I've got a feeling this might be another one of the same. So let's just see. I think it might be. Let me just look. Send me a little bag. Oh, and it's the um, oh, fantastic! Oh, brilliant! It's for um, all your I'm getting closer. It's uh, a DMC shopping list. Um, and basically when you're kitting up something, a pattern, you can use this to mark off how many skeins you need for each one. Oh, this is fantastic. I can um, scan a copy of one of these and um, then I can keep making my own. I've got a little plastic wallet for putting some bits and pieces in. We've got, oh look at this, isn't this beautiful? Oh look at that little heart there. Oh there's a little sampler. It's blurry for some reason. Oh, oh there's some cute ones in there. So that's that one. Let's, um, let's just throw all the rubbish over there and then I'll sort it out in a minute or two. Okay. <laughs> oh, come on. Out you get. There we go. <sighs> this is like a workout. I'll tell you what, let's move that down here. 
and then that's better. Now we've got more room. So, let's see what we have in this little package. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> That's one that people probably don't want to see. Oh, I love the little extra pattern. Wow. <gasps> peacocks, 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 peacocks. Oh, that one's pretty. That's nice. Oh, look. Wow. Oh. A little angel. That's what this one is. Little boy and a girl on the beach. Oh, wowzers. Look at that one. Isn't that pretty? Oh, my goodness. Oh, we've got a bigger picture there and I'm trying to show you the little tiny one. That is lovely. Oh, my. Now, my son is going to go crackers. My son is going to go absolutely crackers. He loves space. Absolutely loves space. Brilliant. Um, I think this one is just <clears throat> just some flowers. I don't, there isn't a picture with that one. Um, there isn't a picture with that one either, but that one looks like a rose maybe. Um, I've done one of these little trees before um, I'll have to see if I can find it Disney um, these um, are what I actually started off cross stitching was the um, designer stitches uh, Winnie the Pooh and Friends Oh wow, look at him. King of the jungle. Lovely. Oh well, there's so much here to keep me going. So, so much here to keep me going. Sorry you're getting glare. I'll try and angle it so that you're not getting the glare. Wowzers. Oh! It's a little baby one. Isn't it cute? Oh, we got. We got a dragon. Oh, Alice in Wonderland. Alice in Wonderland. Amazing. Ooh. Oh, look, this one. This is pretty old, I think. 1996. The Wild Rose Fairy. And in here, it tells you, you know, how to do your cross stitch, how to back stitch, how to do your half cross. How to do French knots. French knots are something that I am not super duper with, I'll be honest. Um yeah, I'm 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 not too good with French knots. I think that's it. Um I actually did um I'll get it out uh, maybe for another video later. Um I actually did um 
the Aurora Borealis and it's in the scene, um, it's snowing and I mean there must be about a million French knots on this thing and I have I've, I've stitched the entire thing. I, I haven't backstitched. I'm not a massive fan of backstitching. I can see what the picture is. The picture looks absolutely gorgeous without the backstitching. And I wasn't about to do about 4 million French knots. So um, I decided that maybe I would seed bead where the French knots were supposed to go. So I need to get some seed beads. Um and have a look into that, see what that would look like. Okay, let's see what's in here. Oh wow! Oh, oh, hang on, there's something else in here. The snips. Maybe they're better than the ones that I have now. <laughs> So we got some snips. Uh, brilliant. Oh look. Oh, we've got a hoop. And we have threads. Now I have never used these threads before. I am presuming it's just going to be the same as using um, DMC. Wow, oh, let's have a look at what colours, what colour threads are. Oh, there's some needles. Got some needles. Number 26 needles. Uh, let's have a look at what colour threads we've got in here. Let's see. So we have like a, a baby blue. We have um, a bright pink. Oh, wow. my favourite colour. Purple. Uh, we have orange. I'm trying to angle things so you don't get glare from the light. Um, oh, we have metallic green. Wow. Um, this is another metallic. Oh, gold. Uh, oh, we have a lighter pink. This is a metallic. Oh, my goodness me, look at that. How pretty. And we have like a pinky purple. I quite like this colour too because it's sort of in between. Um, and then we have a red. We have like a a pale, a, well not pale, a light turquoise. Oh, we got some more of that one. That's metallic. Oh, we have metallic red. Silver! We have metallic silver. Oh, look. Oh, just look. Metallic purple. Amazing. Oh, wow. I love those. Absolutely love those. Fantastic. Cool. Okay. We are not done yet, folks. Oops. I don't think there's anything else in there. No. Put you over there. Oh, we have some little crusted bits. There's a little cupcake. Isn't that cute? That's cute. Oh! Now you know that's getting made for me. What is? Oh, there we go. Oh, look! I could do that for my mum. Oh, 
Oh, and it's got a little hoop in it and a needle. Oh, isn't that cute? Oh, wow. Okay, no, we're still going, folks. We're still going. Oh, we have a card. <laughs> Thanks a bunch. Thank you, Carrie. Thank you. I shall put you up there. Um, okay. Um, hold on, hold on a minute, folks. I'm, I'm a bit confused here. Hold on. Give me a moment. Please hold. And advise that we'll be with you shortly. Is this a separate bag? Yes. Yes, it is. Okay, so we'll open that separate bag in a moment. Let's have a look in here first. Ooh, we got a kit. Oh, wow. Oh, would you look at that? It's 100 by 45. Wow. Okay. I'm in love with that one. That is absolutely stunning. I've got to open it and see how many colours there are. Yeah, how do you open this thing? Here we go. Look at that. Stunning. Yeah, that's... Um, How many colours? Only 28. Really? Oh, okay. I suppose it is only really purple, isn't it? So. And the key on here won't match the canvas by the looks of things. Okay, we've got hanks and needles and thread and wow. Oh, wow. See, now you're just encouraging me to start another one, aren't you, Carrie? <laughs> it's bad influence on me, girl. Alright, then let's get this other bag open. Oh, really? You won't even cut that? Are you being serious? Yeah, these are about as useful. Well, they're not even as useful as a chocolate fire guard. Oh, we've already established that. Now, I believe this is the magnifier. Yeah. So Yeah, that'll be um that'll be useful. Especially considering I have just bought um the uh sixteen and eighteen count um kits from FG Normal. Um, so yeah, that will be uh, very handy then, I am sure. I have to check what everything is, because she did say she was going to throw in a few extras, so 
I think I don't want to uh, be showing off anything I shouldn't be. We've got a mermaid. And a dolphin and a turtle and a seahorse. Oh look, and Peter Pan. Fantastic. And there is in this one. Uh, a piece of a fabric 55 centimeters by 52 by 25 centimeters sorry and it is sparkly i don't know if it's picking that up on the camera but it's sparkly wow 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 i am so 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 impressed right now i really am And that is the, our lot after this one. Um, let's open it from this side, seeing as it's already slightly open. So, oh, Ada. Oh. Oh, okay. Um, this one won't fray. Oh, okay. Oh, well, that's good. It's um, no fray Ada, so you can cut it however you, you'd like. Um, for example, you know, in, instead of having to cut it like this, you know, for the fray, you can actually cut it in the shape that it's supposed to be. Oh, well, that's, that's really nice. And it's blue. That's lovely. I'm going to have to try that out. I've never actually heard of that before. Uh, what do we have here? 15 by 18 cross stitch fabric. Um, that, that looks like it might be a nine count. I'll have to measure it um, and get the squares per inch. And then we have some anchor. Uh, 11 count this is 32 by 46 and there is a needle in here and a thread card <clears throat> there's a big piece of fabric there oh no six there's six pieces in here Fairly good sized pieces, to be fair, good, uh, and we have Ada Band, I've never used this but now I have some, I can try it out, Ooh. now there's a thought. It's pretty. Wow. That's it. Well, wow, that was worth the wait. Um, fantastic. Uh, I'm very, very pleased with everything that I got. Carrie, you should say so you should be uh, relieved to know that I'm happy with everything. I'm sure you could tell by my voice. I was like a child at Christmas. Um, I'm like that every single time I open things. I mean, when I, it comes to opening my things from FG Normal, when they come, oh gosh, yeah. I don't know how I'll contain myself to make a video, <laughs> to be fair. But we'll give it a go. We'll give it a go. Um. So, yeah, I have got an unbelievable amount of things here to um keep me going for quite some time. Um, yeah, <laughs> excellent. 
so so very pleased right well thank you very much for watching this video um if you like it please give it a like um and if you haven't already subscribed please consider subscribing um and if you know of anybody that um you know might appreciate my videos then please share me along to them um and help build my stitchy family um so thank you very much guys i appreciate you all so until next time take care bye bye